The basics that we learned in last week's parasha of the, one of the 600 mitzvot, 613 mitzvot of amitecha. You must rebuke your brother. He knew the basics. And Chafetz Chaim says, when he heard something on a tree, he's like, wait, it's Shabbat. You're not allowed to climb a tree on Shabbat. Let me go stop them. So they don't desecrate Hashem's name and be a Mechalev Shabbat by climbing a tree on Shabbat. So he didn't stop learning. He went to fulfill a mitzvah. But the fact that the Satan had permission, he was able to remove the stair and it made him slip and it made him stop thinking momentarily of Torah and that was the moment. Why? Because Hashem decreed it to be that moment. It wasn't because he got up. It wasn't because he made a sin. The limitation is in our understanding, not in David HaMelech, not in our Torah. There's a decree in Shemayim. But the point here is that we see how zealous David HaMelech was, how honest he was. Just hearing some, a possibility of somebody making a sin already made, him, made his heart break. How could somebody sin against my father? <coughs> How could somebody go climb a tree on Shabbat be a Mechel Shabbat? How could it be? Today, unfortunately, we have people driving on Shabbat. Nobody says anything to them. No one says anything. No, I don't know him well enough. No, I know him, but I don't want to hurt him. No, I know him, but he, maybe he's going to stop on his own. Everybody has 500 excuses of why they're not going to tell anybody anything. 